Oh, well, since I'm kind of here, I guess we'll just sort of try and figure out what I've done, but collectibles. Oh, wow, look at that. We've collected some some good stuff here. I'm not sure if it's a glitch, to be honest with you. Ooh, check out the spooky eyes. No, I can't believe it. My Jackie couldn't have done it. Why did she try to kill me? What's wrong with her? I should return to my ward as soon as possible. Uh, let's see here. So, that's cool. Uh, I'll show you guys a bit of a trick that kind of typically works with elephant games. Let's see if this works. So we're going to do uh, reset. And then we're going to say, are you sure you want to restart from the beginning? And then we say, no. Then we say, continue. Let's see if that worked. It worked! That always works. I shouldn't say that always works. That tends to work with elephant games, is you trick the game into resetting, but not say yes, and then it seems to fix any kind of hiccups and glitches. Great! Now I know Howard's address. I'll go there and search his apartment. If you find these keys, please return them to this address. I'm here at Howard's apartment building. His apartment's on the third floor, but some utility workers are blocking the front of the building. Okay, this seems very dangerous. You've got a live wire, and then you've got this the fire hydrant just spilling out water everywhere. Oh, I love that it's got elephant games on the sign there. That's good. Get into Howard's apartment. I don't think we should go anywhere near this guy. Like, look at the sparks going on over there. Oh, uh, this key? Will that key work? No. Okay. Oh, don't forget, folks that are watching the live stream, we are looking for collectibles, like that one. We're also looking for morphing books, so don't forget to keep an eye out for that. Okay. Yeah, I did have a very short-lived affair with a crowbar. And I defeated that crazy super puzzle. Some parts of the pyramid puzzle go here. Ooh, it's a very nice Hanoi puzzle. Looks like we're going to have to take that out. This panel opens with a key shaped like a lightning ball. Oh, we need to get that key then. Alright, thanks for stopping by, Hannah. We'll see you next time. Ooh, it's Jacob the Electrician. He works for Elephant Games, apparently. <laughs> okay, good. Now, what can we do here? Uh, no. Yes. Now we have the switch. Now it's safe. I think. Either a fuse is missing or the door won't open. Can we use a coin as a fuse? No, we cannot. Alright, well at least electricity is down. Let's go inside. Yeah, I like the elephant games uh, side there. It's pretty cool. Oh, there was a morphing object right there. I guess that one wasn't a book one. Oh, look at the kitty cat. I love how that she's frozen, but the kitty cats aren't. We saw that earlier, too. Right? Where the uh, kitty cats were guarding that yarn bag. And they were not frozen in time. I thought that was kind of neat. I see a chicken leg in that crochet bag, but I can't get to it. <laughs> Why is there a chicken leg in there? We need to find and interact with all the elements in the corridor to gain entry to Howard's apartment. Okay. What exactly is this talking about? Oh, I gotta put him over here, apparently. Uh, da -da 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 -da. Did we do it? 
here. Oh, it's a puppy dog. Aw. Ooh, a sharp glass shard. Whoa. Sorry, dog. That dog is so unfriendly. Maybe a food treat will calm him down. What exactly is this all about? Have to figure out the code or something. Blue, blue? Oh, my neighbor Howard Kelly behaves oddly. There is a constant noise in his room, including shouting and murmuring. My child can't fall asleep. He is afraid of this neighbor. Take measures. Yeah, we're going to totally steal that uh, chicken thing. Okay, so I'm definitely matching colors. Blue to blue. Of course, that was red. And that apparently is not the right red. Okay, and then we've got red here. I guess that's kind of a pinky color. Ooh, hello, Ty. Let's use... Look at the inventory bar. It shrunk. That's weird. All right, well, now we have that, so we can cut the rope, maybe. No, we cannot. <laughs> okay. Any morphing objects in here? Doesn't this look like one of those railings at a ballet studio? That's what it looks like to me. All right, kitty cat. We're taking the chicken leg, sorry. Here you go. Let's go upstairs now. No, I'm not gonna kill the dog. No, no, no. I now have a glove. I'll screw the light bulb into the socket, so I need a light bulb, do I? Not that one. That one. Let's put the light bulb up here and see what we're going to find. Hit the switch. Okay. Another one of those brute force ones that... How many combinations are there? Ah. Uh, there we go. <laughs> Yikes. No, no, no. We would never do that to a doggy. Fine, and interact with all the elements in the corridor to gain entry to Howard's apartment. Oh, I see. It's kind of like pickup sticks. This is neat. I think. Are these supposed to be bunk beds, aren't they? Apparently we're taking it all down. There you go. Get those bunk beds out of there. You don't long here bunk beds so what else do we have in here it's Kelly's door I have his key though oh he did the math Artemis there's six combinations I don't believe it is that a human body creepy this whole wall is devoted to me why are these walls covered in drawings judging by the time Howard must be in my house now. I need to find out why he attacked me. Creepy. That scares me a little. We have a stalker alert. <laughs> hey, who said that? We need to explore the living room in Howard's apartment and find the first clue. Oh, I don't want to uncover this guy. <laughs> I don't feel like it. Oh no! He's dead! This is the missing landlord! Whoa! Hey Brandon, you gotta watch your language there, mister. Alright, this is the morphing object there. Thank you very much, Raven. That's our collectible as well. Don't forget, we're looking for mosaic pieces too. Okay, who's talking? Oh boy. That man is dead. The landlord's bag is locked up tight. Okay, why am I... Oh, there we go. They locked my inventory bar here. There is an entire investigation of me on the wall. My house on the map. Photos, notes. Howard prepared thoroughly for his attack. Oh, boy. We have a 
Whoa, I don't think I'll find the key to this lock. Maybe I should use more radical measures. <laughs> Evidence. Why can't people understand my passion for the dark arts? It's a science. I want to succeed just like my professor. It was a stroke of luck to find this book of dark magic at the library. The old amulet was another pleasant surprise. I wonder, is it as old as the book? Okay, we need to explore that. We're done that. What's next? <laughs> we have to listen to Creepy Dude. We need to find out how Howard, or what Howard did with the mage's amulet. It looks like another totem used to sit there. Look at the candles are still lit here too. Like how was how did how did these candles not burn down this building? <laughs> how is that even possible? Ooh, I'm afraid to see us underneath this curtain. Oh, it's a bird! Hey, it's Lulu. Do you think this might be Lulu? <laughs> For those of you that are watching right now in the live stream, <laughs> where does Lulu come from? Ah, it's a beautiful cage indeed. Lulu. I better not feed Lulu any Coco Kringle bars. Yes, yeah, she's clever too. She's a clever pretty bird. I think this is going to go here. And that's going to go there. So it looks like we need a couple more pieces here. Oh, we've got a little bit of live electricity. Here, let's just use this metal tool and get electrocuted. No, that's a bad idea. Wow. Oh, thanks for stopping by, Tiger Eye. We'll see you next time. Yes, that's right. Smart. Smart Lulu. Clever Lulu. Beautiful Lulu. So I have a, an adjustable and I have my handy dandy multi-tool. So what can I do in here, game? Let's have a look at our map. Apparently we gotta go back outside. Oh, I see. Uh, oh, maybe I don't see. Not sure what the adjustable would do here. And we don't have the tool there. Ah, uh, okay. Oh, we can shut this off, I think, is the right... This would not be big enough, by the way. Unless we had some super giant adjustable. I'll take that, I'll take that. The landlord for this building is a wanted criminal, according to the newspaper. Hmm. The lock on this child's purse is a strange one. Two owl eyes are both missing. Ring for the pyramid. Oh, it looks like we're going to do a Hanoi tower. Yay! Alright, let's find out. Arrange the rings on the pyramid puzzle by color and quantity. So how easy is this going to be? I'm guessing... Not terrible. Let's see... Put that over there. It's very responsive, I'll give it that. I don't, you know, this is... Oh shoot, that's a one. Oh, Gibbs, you missed that one up. Okay, so let's see here. Put the two there, put the one there. Put that over there. And I think we can just put all these right here. And then we gotta get these out of the way. Oh shoot, okay. Oh, okay, I think I'm actually in trouble here. Ah. Uh, oh no, that's good, that's good, I got it. No need to panic, Gibbs. I got this. Come on. <laughs> there we go. Oh, uh, there we go. Yay. We now have another one of those little PC things. So let's go back in here and I guess put it up on the wall here. Oh, over here. Oh, shoot, and we're actually done. Okay. Uh, not exactly sure what we're doing here. 
So, these are all animals, but I think I need to have yellow up there. There we go. Piece of cake. Now we have a fuse. We're good to go. Let's put this over there and see what happens. It's a button. I need something to push this button. <laughs> I was going to break things. Good grief. Let's go and put that on button over here and we'll see what that helps us out with. Oh, it's a fresh room. To the kitchen! Oh no, we lost the multi-tool. Oh, now I'm sad about that. Wait, there's like stuff like cooking over here. Pizza! Great, I can sharpen the knife here. I need something long to reach that. Rats, the window lock is nearly rusted shut. No one takes care of this place. Uh, okay, we'll take whatever that was. Briefcase disc. What am I doing here? Looks like I need a handle anyways. I think you want to spell welcome, but maybe I'm wrong. <laughs> nice sophisticated cabinetry here. We need an apple. There's quite the hum there. It's kind of interesting. I don't think I'd be touching that uh, pizza. No, that's the wrong spot. Let's go see what the landlord's got hiding in his briefcase. Ah, uh, sure. Now we have this, and we have this. And what else do we have? Something's shoved in there. We're going to need some pliers. Letter wheel. Broken handle. Okay, this is the landlord. He is not alive. <laughs> he is not having a good day by any stretch of the imagination. And it looks like we found potentially our villain's <laughs> lair. And the whole creepy voice in the background is definitely a little unnerving. What exactly do you want me to do in here now, game? I'm not sure if this goes there. Oh, it does too. Oh, enter the electrician's name. Jacob. Come on, Jacob. I'm going in your bag. I'm sure you won't mind. Ooh, pliers and a block and something else. Glue, wooden block. Glue, please. Why can I not glue? Oh, I see. You got to straighten it out. Then I glue. Yeah. I don't think I would want to eat in that kitchen. That kitchen is filthy. Let's go see what we can do now. We do have these pliers, so we should be able to fish whatever's in here out of there. Maybe. <laughs> Maybe not. Okay. What handle did I need to use? Hmm. 